Yo, what is going on everybody? Social here and welcome to 3 Horror Games. What better time to start playing some horror games, guys, as we get closer into the month of October. If you guys like to see videos like this, let me know by hitting that like button. So let's get right into the video, guys. And I hope you let me in, let me in, yeah. Alright guys, here we are jumping in with the first game here, Nocturnal Visit. I've seen it on Itch.io. All these games, by the way, guys, are on from Itch.io. So, game links are in the description along with the description of the game. So, let's start. Let's get right into it. Let, no, let's see. I don't know anything about it. I don't like reading the descriptions because I like to be, you know, spooked. I am ready to leave. Let's go leave then, buddy. When the crosshairs turn red, you can interact by pressing E. Okay, thanks for letting me know. All right, so uh, got a soda can here. A cola looks like. Oh, cross here. We can interact. So I I don't know anything about it. I have to clean my room. Well, yeah, yeah you you really do, bro. You really do. Um, I don't know how this video is gonna turn out, guys. Uh, I'm hoping it turns out good for you guys. Uh, I'm trying to get back into. I should check my laptop before I go. Okay, I'm trying to get back into like. I, uh, oh, spooky, spookiest haunted house. There is no normal house. Its backstory even helps to add to the spookiness. Built in the 60s, this house was a home for several serial killers. Ooh. Jeffrey Dahmer live here? Nowadays, all that's left is the remnants of those of the lives that were taken in this place. Okay, I'll let you guys read that too. Uh, I don't have my glasses on. So, and I'm not about to get them because I don't want to be nerdy social. But there you guys go. You can pause the video if you guys want. Alright, so. Alright, so, okay. E F for flashlight. Yeah, that makes sense. Also, if these games are longer, because I'm not trying to, like, make this video hours long. Uh, if you guys want to see a full video on some of these games... Let me know. I will be happy to make a full video on these games. So, yeah. I will try my best. It's locked. I will look for another way. Because I know some of these games, I think, have multiple endings. Uh, I don't know if this one does. I do not know. But if it does, I'll look into it. I'm hoping it does, because it looks pretty cool. And... What's that? I know you guys heard that. Oh wait, I gotta turn my sound up for you guys. I know you guys heard that. And I'm sorry if the audio was low at first for the game. I fixed it. It should be good now. Alright, so I'm hoping I get spooked because it's really hard to scare me. Oh, I thought something was coming after me. Alright, so let's see what we got going on here. A rundown place. Pretty shitty looking. Looks like a typical house in Detroit. Okay. Can I interact? Some leftovers. Okay. Kitchen knife. Can I have that? The water is running. Well, dripping. I can hear it. Anything in the fridge? A garbage bag. Alright, anything? Oh, freezer? Bags, okay. Well, I don't want to know what those are. This place is such a mess. Fuck yeah, it is. Yeah, it is because there's a serial killer. Doesn't seem edible. No, no, it doesn't. Who knows how long it's been sitting there? Okay, we're gonna forget it never happened. Okay, door seems to be the at least to the garage. Okay. I'm hearing footsteps. I heard. Okay, it's official. Fucking house is haunted. Kind of wigged out. I'm kind of weirded out. You know, I just I said it's hard to scare me. Um, it is. Uh, but I do get the creeps. Like Mr. Teddy right there, just falling. 
Oh, there's a key here. Okay, looks like it's the garage key. Yeet! Okay, I'm getting, I'm running for it. I am running. Dad? Okay, well, we're just gonna ignore it like it never happened. Oh, what's this? A uh, basement key. Oh, always the freaking basement. <gasps> Hello? Dad? You here? Dad? Yeah, I'm definitely going in the basement. Yeah, why not? Oh god, door locked. Oh, you guys can pause. Oh my god. I hear things. There's a flashlight here. Is there blood? There's blood. Okay, uh... And the phone's ringing. Okay, maybe it's the pizza guy. The phone is upstairs. Alright, so let's go upstairs and answer the phone, I guess? I don't know. You know, I've seen a lot of horror movies. That's not something you do. You don't answer the phone, but it wants me to, so... Hello? Must have been the wrong number. Okay, well we're gonna pretend like it never happened. Did the back door just open? Did the back door did, did the back door just open? Hello? Freedom. Freedom. Alright guys, that was Nocturnal Visit. Pretty cool game, I think. So, we're going to move on now to game two. Alright, guys. This one is Wood Trail. Uh, not much on it uh, that I could find uh, yet. There's nothing wrong with that. We can figure it out for ourselves. And as I figure it out right now, there is a blood right here. And it wants me to follow the trail. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to follow the blood trail. Like, who the hell would follow the blood trail? Anyway, like... I know I wouldn't follow the blood trail in real life. I would call the police or I would just get the hell out of there. You know, I would think 6 9 is here. Or something. You know, because he's a rat. Okay, okay, okay. I flicked. Didn't like that. Alright, so. Not much going on here. We just gotta follow the blood trail, it looks like. Um. Yeah. Okay, am I going the right way? Oh, that's the car. I heard him go. Oh my god. Investigate the shed. Like, it's just a shed, dude. He's like, oh my god. And then it's a shed. Like, okay. We get it. We get it. Okay, let's go down the shed. Ooh. There's blood right here. Yeah, that's where the blood's coming from. Hide. Oh god. It was the only place to hide. Like, it was the only place. Oh. Alright, I'm getting the hell out of there, guys. He's got... Okay, run, run. Okay, we know he's a cannibal. And we know he eats people. Uh, we don't know much about it. Or him. Or it. It could be a monster. I don't know. I don't know. It could be a monster. I don't know. I'm just going to keep running. Because that's the, what smart people do. They run. They get the hell out of a situation that they're not supposed to be in. I'm being Warning. This game contains jump scares. And contains... Oh wait. This game game... What? This this game game... Okay. I'm not even going to attempt to read that because I thought it was... What the fuck? Okay, so I'm starting to think it's a loop game. This doesn't make sense. No, it doesn't. But we're just gonna redo it. That's what we do. We just redo... Is there a barrier here? I feel like there's a... I should, I should be dead. Objective. Follow the trail. Okay. You know, I don't know what he is. Could be a cannibal. I played the forest, so I know. 
cannibals. There's that damn cough again. He needs to stay six feet away from me. Just saying. Six feet. Biden will not like that. Well, great. I'm back here. We'll investigate the shed. Yeah, well, we're back and we're going to investigate the shed. But, you know, as I was saying before I got really into... I'm hearing shit. I'm hearing shit. Back to the bloody area. Can I, like, check it? Oh, it says hide. I can smell you. He can smell me. Run. He can smell me. Okay, so let's not get hit by the car again. I don't know if that was, like, supposed to happen. I don't know if I was supposed to get hit by the car, but I'm going to run for my life. That's what I do. I run, and I'm going to run, and hopefully we don't die again. Uh, if we do, um, oh, well, we die, we die. Um, I can't, I can't run over again. Yeah, don't get run over. Just Okay, I should wait until it goes by. Okay. Oh, my fucking God. All right, guys. That game crashed for some odd reason. Um, I don't know if that was the end of it. I will tell the developers maybe they could fix it. Uh, but that link is in the description also, guys. So, let's move on to game three. Alright, guys. Here we are in our third and final game right here. This one is make sure it closed. It says it's a short horror game. So, it probably won't be that long. But, you know, what better way to end off the video. But we're going to start this off right here. Dear Alex, Mom and I went to dinner with the Russells. The fuse in the garage is broken, so the motion sensor might... Might make the garage door get stuck. Make sure it's closed before you go inside. We left some money for pizza. See you. See you soon and be safe. Love, Dad. Okay. Sorry. My reading sucks because I don't got my glasses on. So, I think it's about... The developer says about a fear he had as a child or something. So, we're going to see. I don't know much about it. All I know is we have to try to close the garage door. And that's what we're going to do. Apparently it's a horror game, so, you know, I like these PS2, PS1, not PS2, PS1 style games. Uh, okay, didn't close, why not? Alright, I guess we're just gonna keep trying. Uh, I saw that. You see that shit? Alright, we're gonna keep it, close the garage door again. There's nothing worse than the power going out in the middle. Hello? Look at his feet. Sir? Stop drawing on my garage door, asshole. What's he doing? Uh, sir? No, 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 no. Close. Aw, oh, shit. You didn't get me. Uh. Okay, I got it. I got it, guys. We're good. We're safe. <gasps> what the fuck are you, happy smiley face motherfucker? Make sure it closed. So I guess an indie game just turn off when they're done. Alright, guys. That was the three horror games. I know the last one was kind of short. Well, it was short. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to smash the like button. And sub for more content like this. If you guys want to see more of these three horror games. Let me know. Also let me know in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>